the game. Okay guys, pretty 22 here. Back with another video. Today we are doing the human mail challenge. It's the first time I've ever done this. See, I've got a box here, a big box. And I've got another box in front of me. If you can see there. So uh, now we begin making the box. I'll come back to you when it's done. Okay, let's see, what do we need first? Food, water, shelter. Well, the box is going to be our shelter, but not a very good shelter. So, with the help of Witherbone 06, we'll do it. I can't really do a time lapse. Because, you know, I just got to do this fast, and I don't have time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. So, uh, let's do this. Right now, I don't have Witherbone 06, but I think he might be the one mailing me. I haven't discussed it with him. But anyways, I haven't... I haven't got it where I'm going to mail myself. It might be a little dangerous, but uh, of course we're going to need like a pillow and stuff. If you're getting thrown around and all that. I mean, there are a lot of other videos that I think are fake, but I mean, if you're getting thrown around there, boom, 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 in a cardboard box. Wouldn't that hurt? So get a travel pillow or a toilet seat for your head. Travel, travel pillows are just soft toilet seats. Really, you should buy them for making your toilet seat soft. And, Stop him. Anyways, let's get to let's get to the box. So first, you'll need these two boxes like this. I'll be using those. Now I'll get the scissors and duct tape. I forgot the duct tape was in the garage. Let's see, it should be over here. I do have this tape, but it's not really duct tape. But it'll have to do. Psych. Here we go. You can see I have to hold this around my neck because I kind of using my hands to hold the scissors and the camera so I <laughs> uh, kind of hurts. But let's get to it. Well, sorry for the lawnmower in the background, but we got the box. Now just a little tape. This shouldn't be that bad. But how am I going to get in? Oops. Technical difficulties, please stand by. Here we are, boys. We got it. I did the box. But personally, by me. There's your little hole. There's your whole door right there. Pretty sure I didn't make it big enough, but gonna deal with it. Yeah, maybe should have made it a little bigger. Mm, too late. Let's go in. Uh, that didn't sound very good. Oh. It's okay. I'm gonna need a real flashlight for this. Well, I'm in the box. Sorry if that smile was a bit creepy. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna bring a flashlight in here too. Oh. Here we go, in the box, after I get food and everything. Honestly, this stuff is really dangerous, even though everyone says don't try it at home, like I am right now. That just makes the kids want to get more good looking. Why even bother saying that? Saying that? Can't wait until Witherbone 06 sees this. He's going to poop himself, probably. All I did, all I had, all I needed were two cardboard boxes, some red duct tape, and a pair of scissors. That was easy. It only took me about five minutes. What a success. Now let's see if it holds up to the number one way of breaking boxes by mailing them. Dun, dun, dun. I also have this little flashlight that's also a whistle. That's also a thermostat. That is even a compass. We're all good, boys. Back in the box. Now let's test out the flashlight in here. Almost in there. 
Ooh, that part of the box is, doesn't look so good. Then I have to tape some things up from inside the box. It works. It works. Oof, these looks starting to split apart. I knew I should have made that door big, bigger. These look. Well, you can't really see. Okay, but there you. There, do you see it? Anyways, but I'll tape this some more, and then we're all set. Just get some stuff in here too. Phew! I thought the video just ended. That was a close one. So now, look at the box. So um, I made I made it up where I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to the beach. Mail myself to the beach. Now this is gonna be fun. Maybe Area 51. Cool aliens. <laughs> I'm joking. Or is Topsy? Anyways, let's just get to this. So the drawbridge works well. Now just return. Return the um, uh, scissors, and we're good. Bam, we're back. Now, time to get back in here. Whistle, flashlight. Oops, hit my tablet. Now, look, we're all good. Now, get in the box. Okay, this is really tight, but it's gonna have to do. I'm not sure if cardboard can survive. This. We're in. We're actually in. And it only took seven minutes. It works! I can't believe it works. And you can even see out the little hole. But there's not much there. So let's close this up and we're all we're all good. Oh, this door just doesn't want to close. Oh yeah, the door's gonna have some trouble closing because uh kinda need a grip for the door to close. Get the scissors out of the kitchen again. Darn it. Wait, wait, never mind. Never mind. It works. The door works. Ooh, look at that illusion right there. Wait, it looks like there's two of me. Oh, wait. Whoops. That's just my reflection. Okay. It jump scare didn't come in. <laughs> okay, so uh, we're gonna get mailed now. <sighs> I'm gonna cut out the part where I'm putting the car and so forth. These, you know, it's kind of boring. It's that little air hole on the top so I can breathe. Nope, get the stuff in here. Okay, guys. You can hear some stuff. We're at the post office. We're all good. I don't know if some people get the whole box in their films, but at least I got, you know, this. Ooh, that works well. Wait, you know what? I know where we can mail myself. I'm going to make this a title, too. Mailing myself to some haunted, mailing myself to a haunted house. Let's try it. Obviously, I, I know where a haunted house is. It's not that far. So, uh, shouldn't take too long to mail myself there. And since I'm so light, because no matter what I eat, I never gain any weight. So, uh, should be able to 
should be able to just have a good time mainly myself so might be a bit expensive because of course humans do weigh at least something and uh, we're gonna have to find a cheaper post office because it costs like a hundred dollars for a one pound item I know it sounds stupid but it's reality folks sorry it's a crazy place out there do I see weather 106? let's go, let's go. I'm joking, it's not, because I'm already at the post office. I don't know, I opened the drawer door, but I think they're weighing me. I think they're weighing me. And since you know on the clown videos, we did hear noises in real life, because of course, my hearing is way better than the cameras. Sorry, this looks a little weird. It looks like a special effect. That's kind of cool. But I'm really shining myself with a light in a dark cardboard box, so uh, that's what's happening. <laughs> Behind the scenes, people. <laughs> Yeah, sorry for all the editing. Took a while. Oh, that, that's better. I hear so many noises. Looking out my little window. Yeah, right here. You can actually see me. But that's just like a window of it. So I think they're putting me on the truck. So I'm gonna make sure I'm all good. I do have some food in here. You can hear it moving. So I think it's starting, yeah, the car's starting. So get ready. Making sure this thing's locked tight. Uh, the idea of having a cardboard door wasn't the best because, you know, it fell off, might fall off, and then, I don't know, something would open me up, but let's see. I'll cut out the part because, anyways, this will be a thousand year hours long. Because it's going to take like half an hour to get there, maybe, if we have bad traffic. Is someone, kind of, is someone talking? Ooh, this thing kind of exploded. I was leaning to see out the window and then it kind of burst. The door broke. Poop. Duct tape. Hold, hold up. Oh no, the door. The door's opening. This is pretty funny, but okay. Cardboard's possessed. Just close the door. Yep. <laughs> What if my flashlight runs out of batteries? Sounds like I'm next to a fire truck. That doesn't sound very nice, but I think we're almost there. Oh, huh, I don't need the light anymore. Because the door broke. So at least you can see my face. That's good enough. So if you want to see the box, set, that's that. Do you hear that? Anyways. What's that? I wonder if someone's in the haunted house. You can, you can kind of, kind of see that, that, is that, but uh, I think, I'm going to, I think we're almost there, I'm going to cut out this part, dude, we're really close, we're, I mean, we're really close, it's not even me right now, I mean, I'm trying to, Hold it there to me. Closing the door. I think, gee, I think someone's opening this. I think the light's about to go out because I haven't put new batteries in it for a while.
that whistles. Let's see what temperature is it. It's huh. It's actually 80 degrees in a cardboard box. Yeah, this wasn't very uncomfortable. I mean, it, it wasn't very comfortable at all with the pillow, even with the pillows in here. I'm sitting on them, but it's just uh, very bumpy and not unpleasant. Probably with even another YouTuber in a box. <laughs> but uh, let's I think someone's opening it. I'm saved. I'm saved. They're opening the box through the door. Oh my. I think. Or at least I think we sh I think they're getting me off the truck. I'm just gonna cut this part out because I'm just gonna be saying ow 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 the whole time when I'm you know, when they're putting me down and stuff. But I think like they just stopped the truck. This is gonna be good. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I think we're almost. I think we're almost there because I heard us get off the truck. There's a huge bump off camera. Why hear um, someone? Hello. Yes. Um. We have a delivery here for Brady Twenty Two. His granddad. From what I've seen, you're Brady Twenty Two, right? Hey, Brady Twenty Two's granddad, right? What? This is confusing. I don't know. Just take the box, and I'm gonna get out of here. What? What was that? Okay, I'm I'm getting out of the box. Dude, I think this is the haunted house. I don't know why I thought it was granted. How do you know who I was? Can you hear that? Okay, dude, I think the video is in 17 minutes. And it's raining. But, uh, I, somewhere, for some reason, I'm in, a I'm in a garage. People are talking outside. And it's starting to rain. You can hear some thunder. It's a thunderstorm, but... Overall, I think it's a success. And at least it's not something really weird, so it's not some random dude in California like the first box mailing thing. This one's successful. I mean, that literally barely even took any time at all. I don't know what that dude was talking about, and how do you know I was in there? Probably since I was that heavy. Starting to ring like crazy. But I got it in this. This is the Box Fort video, signing out.